All right, there's sunscreen in here, stand by. Except it's not the fun sun. This is why I put sunscreen on the... Like, look at this. Like, I don't want to use 50 SPF for men. What does that even mean? You can't use it. Okay, cringe. But this what? This one smells like... Not like coconuts. It smells like the aquatic center. It smells like chemicals and death. Connor, are we doing chickens today? That's gotta do it, right? Oh my god, I sprayed the shit out of my shirt. <laughs> that is sad. Oh no, is that bad? Who cares? I do like that. Thank you! I got it from the San Diego Zoo. Maya looks like a chicken with them chicken legs long. Okay, thank you for the sub. It's a good hat? I know! And you know the sick thing about this hat? You guys are gonna shit on me. It's, it's a kid's hat? Um, so it actually fits my head. <laughs> like, it's it's small, and, like, it's snug, it, like, won't fall off. I've never had a hat that I can wear that's actually for sun protection that doesn't just fall off or blow off in the wind. I got a huge brain, though. Don't get it twisted. Thank you for the two months. Dude, that sunscreen smells so bad. It smells like it's bad for you. My stole hat from here. That's not true. I literally purchased it. All right. Parrot time. Parrot time. Hello? Hello? Look at the ground. So I, I gave them, uh, or I made them those egg cartons, the new ones that we got in the P.O. box, the colorful ones. And then I put wood in it. I put these strings in it. I put finger traps with nuts in it. Look at all this. <laughs> Finger traps, I put tissue paper, wrapping paper. This is the macaws boxes. They loved it. They loved it. Siren, do you want to come here? Oh look, this is my, there's a bunch of shit on the ground. They went in on the egg cartons. Whoever bought these from the wish list, thank you so much. Siren, did you like your egg carton? Did you like your egg carton? Was there fun stuff in here? This is so fun. I got one that matches you. That's so nice. What do you think? Do you want a pet? Hello, birdie. That's my favorite sound that she makes. Fun fact. Birdie, can I pet you? Can I pet you? Hi. Oh, that's nice. Hey, what you doing? I'm petting you. Siren, did you do this? Did you do this? That's a lot of stuff to clean up. Hello, that's a lot to clean up. Can I take this? Because you ripped it up. You ripped this up. Good job. You did so good. You did so good. Guys, check out the, the damage. Oh, here she comes. She's back, everybody. <laughs> she's back and she's growling. What? Hello, Mama. Hello, Mama. Hello, Bernie. Yes. Chat, check out Mia's damage on her. Happy birthday. Birthday. birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Chat, check out Mia's damage on her enrichment. Pretty good, pretty good. Pretty good. So, so. <laughs> The reason that it sounds like that is because uh, Kayla's been trying to teach Siren sea shanties. So you know the song that goes like, yo, ho, well, like the low one? She's been trying to teach Siren that, but she only knows how to sing happy birthday. So she can 
Biden's book. <laughs> and she goes, happy birthday. <laughs> Is that a sea shanty? That's really nice. Here's the clip of Kayla singing it. Let's see. What do you guys think? Pretty good, it's pretty good, Siren. That's pretty good. What do you think? So talented. Anyway, that's what you're hearing. Hi, Mia. What are you doing? How are you today? How are you today? All right. All right. We are all swept up. All swept up. So, for cleaning the aviary, we have a few things to do. <laughs> we have a few things to do. Um, that was so good. A sea shanty. A sea shanty. Happy birthday. Yo ho. Um, we're gonna spray down the inside of this enclosure, then we're gonna scrub the floors in there, and then we have to change out all their food and water bowls because they get washed every day. So I like to spray the outside part first because sometimes it needs like two go-overs. So I start there and then I come back and do another pass. Simon! Hello, Mama! Hello! Hello. And then this tree. Little poop. I scrubbed, we also scrubbed the branches in here. Um, but I did it yesterday, so should not need to do that today. This is Mia, she's an African gray. She's amazing. Do the birds like being sprinkled? No, unfortunately they don't. And it would be life-changing if they did. Hi. Hi. That was Mia. Um, because it's so hot. But they hate water, so. Look, a siren feather. This is yours. Thank you for whistling. Cool, right? It's yours. It's a wing feather. It's very pretty. Thank you. We saved the feathers, this is actually really interesting, I'm not gonna explain this very well, Connor could definitely explain it better. But um, we saved the feathers uh, because we can do cortisol testing um, because the feather grows up in bands and we can test the bands for cortisol levels and that way we can literally quantitatively say how happy, not happy, how stressed our birds are in captivity and like if there are certain periods of time where the bands have higher levels of cortisol. We know that they're more stressed at that time. So we want like the lowest levels of cortisol possible. Uh, it's important, especially being online with animals in captivity to be, to be able to give people concrete, like no, this bird is happier than a wild bird would be. Hi, not happier than a wild bird would be. Wild birds are always gonna be happier than captive birds. Um, but you know, that we're doing the best that we can and that this bird is, you know, has a good enough quality of life to still remain in captivity and still be euthanized. Another reminder, if you think you want macaws, no you don't. Look at the two by four in there. That was like pretty recently installed, but the macaws said no. <laughs>